I met Peter Andre. <laughs> did you? I met Peter Andre, everybody. But did that like, excite you? He's or were amazing. you a big Peter Andre fan? I, I mean, I've just... been away from the UK for 10 years. Yeah. So, like, I mean, Peter Andre was. I mean, everyone was a like, Peter yeah, Andre fan up, right? With the tracks right. He's hair. a really That's nice when... dude as well. He's, he seems so lovely. He's super sweet. <laughs> yeah. Congratulations on this film. Thank you. Thank you. Have you guys taken a minute just to kind of sit back and realize what you've been a part of? Because it's huge. Uh, do you want to take that moment hard. now? <laughs> you know, it's it's hard to do that because because of the also I think it's because the release dates have been a little bit staggered. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I thought we were in the clear once we did all the LA <laughs> stuff, and I was like, all right, fantastic, no more like crazy. Yeah. Shit. And then they're like, oh, we got to go to London. I was like, oh, that's right because it's coming yeah. out. It was meant to be coming out here in November. Oh. And then they yeah, so okay. they pushed they it forward to September, forward. which we are so so happy yeah. about. Um, but I had a week in Singapore during the first week that I was out and yeah. things were changing <laughs> for oh, me. I could, I, I, I was, I, really? I, I took a jog and like, literally like, Couldn't there was about anywhere. five people sort of turned around, oh, I gotta watch the movie like last night. My, my wife would love a photo. <laughs> I was just like, oh, okay, okay. <laughs> I'm wow. just sweating. Yeah. That's, yeah. that's not going <laughs> to stop anytime soon, I don't think. In the film, Rachel, when she goes to Singapore and she sees Nick's house for the first time and everything, that feeling of like just being somewhere and not quite believing your life, I guess, is how she feels. Have you guys had that? Have you been somewhere where you've been like, is this my life? Like, is this real? I kind of had it when we came here. Really? Yeah, because I, I think this is one of the nicest hotels that I've, I've sort of stayed in. <laughs> yes. But I've been traveling, I mean, it's so spoiled, but but the good seats on airplanes for this entire time, and I'm just like, wow, this, I could, yeah. like, this is, this is a great life, <laughs> like, very lucky. Yeah. yeah. Um, but those, it's surreal to me, everything that's happening. So. Okay, how about you, John? Um, a little bit. I think all of it's kind of, it's quite mad, like doing the press in America and having yeah. the premiere and, you know, they had us rolling up to the red carpet in like, I, I arrived in like a Ferrari, which is ridiculous. I mean, just, <laughs> it, was, it was ridiculous, but, you know, also that kind of, you know, it all kind of goes away, and then I got to spend some time with my family, and it's made me really appreciate, yeah. you know, quality time. Family. You kind of don't need all the kind of bells and whistles and all the, as much as it's fun having yeah. that it's kind nice of luxury. Sometimes. sometimes, yeah, I'm not going to complain. Yeah. <laughs> but actually, what really matters is, you know, having a good time with your loved ones. And, oh, of course. Yeah. What would a rom-com be without a bit of heartbreak as well, which we see in here? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. What do you think is the best way to deal with heartbreak? As we see how obviously Rachel deals with heartbreak and stuff, how what do you think is the best way to deal with heartbreak? I don't know. You just need time, don't you? Time. And holiday. A holiday with your mates. Just go somewhere new, experience some things. Just get your get your mind out of it. Do do something spiritual. Do something fun. Just Drink wine with, take your with mind a good off. friend. Yeah. Friends. You know. I think time on your yeah. own is quite yeah. good as well. Yeah. <laughs> And um, for the inevitable sequel after the success of this, who would be your dream casting? Someone, I mean, you've already got a stellar lineup for yeah, this we've one. Got a so couple. you've kind of been spoilt, but what would you, uh, who would you like for Jack for the Chan, straight up. I, yeah. think, I think I think there's room for, especially in the second one, yeah. China Rich Girlfriend. Mm -hmm. Imagine Jackie Chan as the billionaire dad. Yeah, it would be brilliant. Oh, that would be so much fun. I love him. Yeah. Who would you? Um, gosh. I heard The Rock wants to play oh my God. something. Because John, John and The I Rock have, have done a movie yeah. together before. I would before. absolutely and love then, to and work And The Rock with rang John and was like, why, did, why didn't you call me um, to be like an extra? I think I was like, you can't. Yeah. So if, if The Rock was in our film, oh my God, that'd yeah. be the best. The Rock is in everything. <laughs> 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 we, we might get him to China if he's on a film. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if he found his way into the sequel, that would be hilarious. I'm sure he could. Like it. <laughs> Guys, good luck with the film. So when it comes out here, you. it's amazing. Thank like you so it's much. done so well. Nice Thank to you. meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.